You are listening to Game Break, brought to you by HNE. This review is written by Nathaniel Sturmberg on Thursday, October 16, 2008, for the game Rock Revolution for all game consoles. In the day and age of music games such as Rock Revolution, factions have formed amongst the fans. Some really like guitar, Hero, others really like Rock Band, and then there are those who play just about anything. Ever fans of both Guitar Hero and Rock Band harshly panned this game. Rumors about its song quality and features were getting out of hand. Konami has promised that Rock Revolution will be playable with any compatible instruments on the PS3 and Xbox 360. It is true, and then some. The Rock Band guitar and drum set for the Nintendo Wii worked with the PlayStation 3 version of the game with only a few minor control issues. The control issues will be discussed later in the review. Players must set in options their handedness when it comes to guitar and how many paths their drums can support. The game's features include quick play, career, multiplayer, and studio, extras, practice, and option modes. Quick play is the option that uh, allows you to play a song. This game's career mode tosses a few musical challenges along the way, creating albums and playing venues. The multiplayer mode is for online and offline play with two or more people. The studio is where players can make their own music. The extras include downloadable content, a leaderboard, top players, and the game's credits. Practice mode allows for the practice of songs as well as just jamming whatever players create. Options are the first place to visit when setting up a band name, controller type, and much more. The game looks great. The band members look better detailed and more realistic than the other games thus far. You can select a character to play the lead instrument on screen, but cannot customize him in her or in any way. While playing music, players are not easily distracted by flashy lighting or imagery because the note bar is vertical from the top to the bottom of the screen. This is unlike the other games where the notes seem to reach halfway up the screen as it gives an illusion of tilting away. The menus are not confusing and the options are neatly categorized. The only downside graphically while playing the song is that the crowd is not very detailed. The sound quality in the game is great. The game includes 40 songs with the ability to download more. Most of the songs sound like they're sung by the original artists, and a few obvious covers do a decent job replacing the original artists. If players have a PS3 or Xbox 360, they are able to speak their, to their bandmates and competitors using headsets while in online matches. If a player owns a Nintendo Wii and there is no universal instrument capability, it, it simply just doesn't exist. For those with the Wii, you have to use the Wii Motes and the Nunchucks while pressing A, B, C, and Z to play certain notes. Essentially, players play air guitar and drums. Due to the limited capabilities of the Wii, some of the graphical quality features have also been held back. If you want to use your Wii Rock Band instruments on your PS3, go to our website and check out the review and it'll tell you how everything translates. Konami released this game without instruments at first, so that Guitar Hero and Rock Band faithfuls would check it out. Once those players had the game, they then released the Superior Drum Set with the game approximately a month later. Konami is either super smart or super crazy. Either way, for a dollar twenty-five a song plus tax, no one can really afford to miss a chance to see what this game offers. To read more in relation to what was covered in this segment, previews, reviews and other game-related articles, log on to www.haslage.net.